Let me try it and see how it tastes. Mm. Yeah, I told you that's the best out of the three. I is it? it. <laughs> and I like how it has a little crumbs of the little little batter around it. Mm -hmm. Really good. So right here, BJ, we are ordering, and of course they have the QR code, the uh, paperless menus, and we are getting, here is the list of the menu, we actually are getting, there's a lot of appetizer options, we are definitely getting the frito mito, misto, that's the crispy uh, flash fry calamari shrimp zucchini mushrooms, that sounds really good, we're ordering that, there's a list of all the other appetizers that they are here. And there's in, there are ensalats, which are the salads. And we have the La Pasta Fata in Casa, which is the homemade pasta. Uh, Magnus, I believe she's having the Chichara al Scoligio. That's the uh, spaghetti with the mussels, clams, scallops, shrimp, fresh tomatoes. And I think I'm having the, the pasta, maybe the linguine or the penne. I'm not sure yet. And they have the soups here. They have secondary plati, which is the main course. You have fish, meat. There's the different types of meats here. So overall, a lot of options here. You can add vegetables to any sides. Gluten-free on the request. And here in BJ, they have a nice selection of wine. They actually give you a wine book here. And there are different wines here. There are different cocktails. There's a cocktails list here. Different types of reds. Whites. Whites, wines from Italy, Piemonte, Arruzzo, Southern Italy. It's like a Bible of wines here. So and there is lots of wines here. If you want a great selection, you can go ahead and check it out. Magnus with her white wine glass. First taste impressions of the wine. So let's try the wine. So this is a white wine. I'm going to pair it up with my seafood dish that I'm going to order. is perfect uh, not too dry not sweet either it's mm -hmm. it's really good let me try again it said the service it had like a melon undertone yeah yeah and in, in the the aftertaste you can you can taste it it's, it's really good it's very refreshing and it's gonna pair up nicely with my seafood platter I got the beach mojito cheers that mojito looks good Oh yeah, <laughs> really good, really minty. Is it good, really minty? Yeah. Yeah, if you like, if you like uh, mojitos, I'm a big mojito fan. It's really good here, the beach of mojito. Oh wow. Yeah, it's Italian style. Italian style, mm. it's strong. <laughs> so our bread has arrived, the bread, different types of breads here. They have the three dip, types of dipping sauces here. We also got our appetizer. Which is with the shrimp, calamari, and I believe uh, fried zucchini. Yeah, Delicious. Fried zucchini. Wow. With a nice sauce. I'm not sure what this pouch is, but I 
double check that. And then the sauce, the marinara sauce. The sauce, marinara sauce. sauce. Beautiful. Very nice. Okay. So I'm gonna taste this first sauce. So there's three different sauces. Let's see this one. First taste of that sauce. I'm not a sauce actually, it's an oil. 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 <laughs> regular olive oil. It seems a little light. Mm. Really good. I like olive oil with bread. Let me try the vinaigrette one here. It looks like it's a, it's a vinaigrette or vinaigrette, something. The vinaigrette, the darker like a, one? The darker one here. Alright, let's try that one. Let's see. It looks scary. <laughs> <laughs> and it looks like dark like chocolate almost. Oh, wow. Yeah. Wow. <clears throat> oh, that was a little kick to there. <laughs> Not spicy. It's a little kick because it's like a vinaigrette flavored olive oil. Mm -hmm. And it's very thick. It's kind of sweet. So it actually tastes really good. I mean, if you're into vinaigrette, um, this is something that you would like. But just keep in mind, just tap it a little bit because it's pretty strong, the vinaigrette flavor. But I like it. Let's try the third one now. All right, and this is another olive oil. Let's see. The difference. I think that one's a little stronger yeah. than the first olive oil. The first one was a little lighter. So I guess it goes up like the strength mm -hmm. from least to, to highest. Yeah. So the two olive oils are good. I think my favorite, crazy or not, is that vinaigrette one. I mean, the dark it's one. It's different. Mm. And it's sweet with that little vinegary taste at the end. It's really good. I actually found out the pouch was actually a lemon. So. <laughs> <laughs> I like the way they... <laughs> yeah, it looks like, like a little they gift. They wrap it. It's like a little gift. Yeah, and you put it... I'll squeeze it right through the, through the little netting here. So. Yeah, and very squeeze it cute. Squeeze to the... To the uh, shrimp. Zucchini and the calamari itself. Let me try it without dipping it in. Fry calamari. Mm. Nice and soft, actually. The calamari, the calamari itself is soft, but the breading the fry is really good. Mm. And now, the shrimp. I'm gonna dip it into the marinara sauce. Yeah, I see it. Mm. You want only those? Yeah. How is that? Mm. Oh, wow. Delicious. I think I like the shrimp better than the calamari. <laughs> yeah? And then finally, I'm going to try the zucchini. Right here. And I'm going to dip a little bit in marinara sauce. Right here. Mmm. The zucchini just melts in your mouth. So really good. good? Yes. Oh wow, I think that zucchini is actually my favorite of the three. Really good? But yeah, it really is really great. The calamari, the shrimp, and the fried zucchini with the marinara sauce and the lemon. Excellent choice for appetizer. Really good. Okay, so let me try the calamari now. I'm gonna get my opinion on the calamari. Dip it in Dip the marinara. It in the marinara. Mm. Really good, it's nice and soft. The outside batter is fried really good. And it's nice and soft. It's not like chewy. Perfect. Let me try the let me try a little piece of zucchini. Yeah, zucchini is gonna melt in your mouth. Yeah, I can see it already. <laughs> I'm cutting it, it's already like and zucchini is already soft as it is. Let me try it and see how it tastes. Yeah, I told you, that's the best out of the three, it isn't melted. it? <laughs> and I like how it has a little crumbs of the little little batter around it. Mm -hmm. Really good. Let me see how good that purple vinaigrette is. Let's see. Yeah, you're going to love it, babe. Watch. That is pretty thick. Careful. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, my God. Wow. <laughs> it's really good, right? Yeah. And what do you think about the bread, too? The bread is really the good, bread, nice yeah. and toasty, right? But with that purple vinaigrette out of the three dippings, that's excellent. Definitely, oh, definitely that's my favorite. So good. And I just realized 
It has mushrooms. Look at these fried mushrooms. So delicious. I did not realize that. Let's go ahead and I'm gonna try this out with some marinara sauce. Let's try that mushroom. Mm. <laughs> I love mushrooms. And that fried, the fried pudding over it with the marinara sauce. Oh man. Actually, I, I said that the zucchini was my favorite. Actually, it's the mushrooms. <laughs> so I did get the bolognese here with the thicker pasta. I just put some Parmesan cheese on it. It looks so good. I, I heard it takes six hours to do this bolognese. It has pork, has meat, and it has veal in it. Wow, delicious. And Mavis got the seafood pasta here that has the clams, the shrimp, and I think mussels also. Mussels. Wow, delicious. Scallops. Scallops. Yeah. Wow. All right, first taste test. Ooh, Let's yeah. Let's see here. Wrap that spaghetti. <laughs> mm. Oh, that looks so good. Ready? Yeah. Mm. A lot of pasta mm. there, huh? Oh, wow. Wow. The noodles, oh, the spaghetti taste fresh. It's seasoned very well. And it's kind of like thick. Yeah. Let me try now one of the shrimps. Let me try it over here. Look at the shrimps, how big they are. Let me see. Oh, wow. Yeah. So really the big. shrimp is really big. Let me try. Mm. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Looks well cooked, huh? So good. It is so thick and good. Mm. Really good. Let me try one more thing. And that is the mussel. See this little pretty mussel yeah, here? I'm here using my. <laughs> mm, yeah, it doesn't want to get out. <laughs> it doesn't want to get out. Does it want to come out? Let's see. Mmm, so good. Really delicious. Mmm. Nice and soft. And it has like this little sauce which makes it, gives it that extra mm, flavor to it. Really good. It's bolognese time. Let's go ahead and try this. I'm gonna wrap it on here. And you can see the pasta's really thick. Let me show here on the pasta. Here. Yeah. Oh yeah, it's a thick noodle. Thick so noodles. Thick pasta. All right. Bon appetito. <laughs> wow. That pasta's soft. The bolognese cook well. I can definitely taste the veal, the pork, and the meal there. And like I said earlier, they took, they take six hours to make the bolognese here. And it's homemade pasta, which yes. they do right here in BJ. So, yeah. delicious. I definitely recommend if you like bolognese, like traditional kind of spaghetti, but with a thicker uh, noodle, definitely try this. Really good. So Magnus did get the strawberry caprioska. Yeah. As you can see here. Oh, that looks good. Look at the it chunks of strawberry. It looks so good. It got chunks of strawberries there. A lot of ice here. Mm -hmm. Let's try. Let's see. First let me taste. let me stir it a little. You stir it a bit, huh? Because sometimes all the strong stuff is in the top. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Let's see. Let's taste test. Whoop. The strawberry is sticky. <laughs> Wow, this is very strong. <laughs> strong drink, huh? Ooh, it kind of tastes like a like a lemonade, mm -hmm. but like a strawberry strong lemonade. Oh, yeah. strawberry lemonade. Mm. You can taste a vodka in there, <laughs> and the vodka is very strong, but it it you can taste the strawberry flavor. Mm -hmm. You can tell it's nice and fresh. Yeah, really good. Look at look at those chunky of oh, the the strawberry right there. Yeah, it's really good. Oh yeah, look at that. Wow. You see it? Yeah, Big it's chunks, really yeah. good. So it's like a spiked strong strawberry. <laughs> mm. Now for dessert, we did say it was anniversary, so it was a complimentary uh, cream, what was it cream cheese? It's a cream cheese or cupcake. Che cream cheese or cheesecake with cupcake with cream. vanilla ice cream. And uh, some um, some sauce here with the strawberries. It looks like it's a lemon. Lemon, and then it says happy anniversary for us. On top of that, we did order our own desserts just to show what they have here. Magba's got the tiramisu here as, as house made. They make it right here in Biche, as you can see, delicious. And tiramisu is always good uh, with the coffee 
uh, which Magnus is drinking. Uh, she's drinking a cappuccino, and it's it's a great you know it's a great classic uh, traditional Italian uh, dessert here. They also make house made sorbet, and I, lately I've been loving sorbet here, and I got the lemon and raspberry sorbet. It looks so good. It looks like a rose almost. <laughs> How delicious it looks. Can't wait to taste it. Yum. Let's taste this. Let's taste anniversary pastry here. Mm, taste a little this. bit of that. Sauce there. Let's see. Mm. No. So good. How is it? Mm, it's delicious. Let me try it again. Mm. Is it like, like a cream puff kind of? Mm -hmm. That's what it is. It's a cream puff. It kind of tastes like a pound cake. Okay with the ice cream, so it's nice, and you mix it in with that little lemon or lime. Um, was it sauce? Sauce, yeah. or dessert Drizzle, sauce. Drizzle, yeah. Really good. Let's try this sorbet here. This is the raspberry sorbet. Mm. Mm. Oh, wow. Is it mm. good? Really good, tart. More on the sweet side, actually, with the raspberry. Mm. So it's sweet and tart. <laughs> My Let me try the lemon with a little bit of raspberry hanging on there. <laughs> yeah, the lemon's more tart, <laughs> but I like it because it's very sweet. A little bit of tartness added with the lemon sorbet with the tartness. It's a great combination. I like something light for dessert, so why not the home house made uh, sorbet here? It's really good. Mm. Mm. Wow, right. tiramisu time. Now it's tiramisu. I love to an airy. Tiramisu is one of my favorite desserts after um, creme brulee. Mm -hmm. It's tiramisu, and then it's cheesecake. So I have a couple of favorites, but tiramisu is it's, it's on my list of favorites. Let's try. See the little layers of the tiramisu. Let me back up here. Oh yeah, there you go. Yes. Oh, okay, different type of layers. Yes. Yeah. Okay. See it? Mm-hmm. Try. Mm. Oh my god. It's really good. The, each layer has a, like a little different flavor. What I do like about the tiramisu, the tiramisu, just like creme brulee, it's always very light. Yeah, like an air, yeah. It's, I like light desserts, especially after an Italian dinner. Mm -hmm. <laughs> heavy Italian dinner. Heavy Italian dinner. So you want something that's light and not so heavy. So. I love it. It's really good, very light. I love the presentation on the plate. Yes, I love it too. They always put the little food presentations. Mm -hmm. I love. And this has like a, it's like a caramel with a chocolate oh, yeah. and it's just so good. Mmm. Mmm. And it goes well with your cappuccino, correct? Oh yeah. Let me try my cappuccino. Mm -hmm. I gotta have either coffee or cappuccino here. It's all Let's nice get a and nice shot there. Oh, espumante. Yeah. Espumante, yes. <laughs> Nice foam. Mm. Goes well with the thermosu. Goes soup. well with the thermosu. Perfect pair up. Really good. Alrighty, so we just came eating from um, the beach. We're doing a review, actually ending the review here at yeah. the Plaza Sensor here in Portofino Bay. Just to be outside in the air. So how was how was your impression of beach? My impression was great. It was fantastic, phenomenal. It was really good. I mean, the service was great. Mm -hmm. The food was fantastic. Oh, excellent. I mean, that seafood dish that I had was, oh wow, it yeah. was really good. The pasta tasted fresh. Mm -hmm. It's homemade here, so it's fantastic. Yeah. There was nothing I could say. Desserts were great. The drinks were great. Everything was really good. My uh, my the uh, the appetizers, the calamari, the mm -hmm. fried shrimp was delicious. Mm -hmm. The bread with the vinaigrette, that purple vinaigrette, that was one of our favorites. Um, yeah. The the pasta that I got, the bolognese. Oh man, it, like I said, it was uh, six hours to make that bolognese. Yeah. And the pasta's homemade also in Biche. It was delicious. I definitely recommend. Uh, like I said earlier, definitely recommend that um, that dish. Magnus seafood was great. Yeah. Uh, the dessert was awesome. The yeah. the, the tiramisu. The tiramisu was delicious. Yes. It was light. It's it's a light dessert mm -hmm. right after your meal. 
So it's it's really good pairing after your meal. So it's wonderful. It was delicious. Yeah, my sorbet was excellent. It was very yeah, light. Yeah, that was good too. I the, had a little bit. It was really <laughs> good. <laughs> the raspberry mixed with the lemon sorbet, it gave us, you know, that tart, sweet tart taste was delicious. Yeah. As you saw, they gave us the anniversary. Uh, complimentary oh, yeah. anniversary uh, pastry yeah. with the ice cream and then the actual it was like a muffin it kind of tasted like a pound cake it kind of it was like a pound cake with yeah. some vanilla ice cream and the presentation alone well, nice. was really cute the happy and anniversary nice. I, loved I it. mean we didn't ask for anything much because we still got our own dessert just to show, share with you all mm -hmm. how the desserts are what they look like here but it was really good yeah. it was delicious overall the atmosphere was great like I said if uh, the server was his name was Paul if uh, you come and see him just like me he gives a great service to just like I give you great videos. Yeah. So. <laughs> but overall, it was a great dining experience. We definitely enjoyed it for our anniversary. Uh, with that, if you did enjoy this review, please like, share, and subscribe. subscribe. And with that, it was a fantastic meal. It was a fantastic meal. Yes. <laughs> and with that, we'll see you on the next Mactastic Productions. Productions. Bye. Bye.